Yeah, Mitch Tabell talked to us from inside the 4th Avenue jail earlier this afternoon. He spoke for nearly 12 minutes straight, hardly pausing for long enough to ask him any questions. And then he abruptly ended the interview and walked out. Okay, everybody's recording Eager to share his story with the news media, Tabell claims he did nothing wrong when a DPS sergeant tried pulling him over for an illegal lane change Wednesday. There's no probable cause. It's absolutely legal to resist rest uh, with force to the extent of taking an officer's life if necessary. Instead, Tabell, a self-proclaimed sovereign citizen, sped off. You, sh you don't have to stop if, if there is, or you shouldn't have to stop um, if... Uh, the law is very, you don't have to stop. The law is actually quite clear. You must stop for law enforcement vehicles, even unmarked ones. The 60 mile chase ended when his SUV collided head on with another driver in Tempe. The woman behind the wheel has a broken hand and foot. This was his response when asked about her. She should file a joint suit along with me against the city because I, I said to the police twice and I said to the mayor, I said, look, I don't want to jeopardize anyone's safety. They're making an unreasonable, unlawful stop. I was stopping to get gas, and uh, they attacked my vehicle and bumped into it in unmarked vehicles. Now in jail, Tabell says he plans to sue for what happened yesterday. He claims he's filed lawsuits against police departments before, saying his rights were violated. But exactly how many, and has he ever won? That's a question he didn't want to answer. That's it. We're wrapped up today. So Ladies and gentlemen, thank you very much for coming. I'm out of here. Now, we put in requests to interview inmates in all high-profile arrests. Most of them say no. In this case, Tabell's lawyer even advised him not to, but obviously he had, uh, he had a lot he wanted to say. Lauren Reimer for Arizona's Family.